you wanted to be big. I heard you wanted to be what? Massive. Cut. Lee? What's good, everybody? Hey, look, check this shit out, bruh. Check this shit out. I thought I was going to slap the shit out of this dude in the gym today, bruh. And let me tell you a reason why. Let me tell you this reason. Okay, so I'm working out. You know, he, he's asking me, he's like, hey, man, how you know you get your traps big? Because I feel like when I'm doing them, he's like, hey, basically, yeah. Look, he's just asking me how to complete an exercise, right? So we're sitting there and we're talking, and he's like, hey, man, you see that dude on the treadmill over there? Dude in, like, the red shirt. Look at his fat ass running on the treadmill. Look how he's running. Okay, like, and? And he's like, you know, man, it's crazy to see a fat motherfucker running like that. I, like, okay, like, that's 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 pretty fucked up, bro. Like, what, what are you talking about? And he's like, you know what, man, I think it's just so funny when fat people come in the gym and they, you know, they working out and, like, they start sweating real hard. Bro, shut the fuck up, bro. Shut up. That's exactly what I told him. I was like, shut the fuck up, bro. And he looked at me. He was like, what's up, sweet? You good? I was like, bro, why the fuck you picking on people, bro? And he's like, no, nah, man, no, 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 no. You know, I'm cool with everybody, bro. He was like, I'm just talking about that dude on the treadmill. And I was like, bro, he's in a facility to better himself. Like, what the fuck are you talking about? And he's like, nah, man, I wasn't even saying nothing like that. He's like, you know, I was just talking about the way he was running and how, like, he was just a fatter guy. And I was like, like, honestly, bro, you should really just stop talking because of everything that you're fucking saying right now, you're just digging a deeper hole, bro. And I have no respect for that shit, bro. I have no fucking respect for people in the fucking gym that sits here and talks shit about other people in the fucking gym. Now, if... I'm in the gym, and I see a dude talking shit, you know what I mean, being arrogant, lifting with horrible form. Hell yeah, I'm going to say something. Yeah, I'm going to talk shit about you. you know what I mean, unfortunately, yeah. I mean, what the fuck are you going to do? You talking shit like you're big and bad, and then your form is all fucked up and all that. So, yeah, I'm, I may talk to somebody and be like, hey, that dude over there, bro, he's a sack of shit. You know what I mean? Fuck it. I say it to your face. I don't care. But when you see somebody in a gym that is overweight, uh, morbidly obese, or anything like that, like... It's not funny to sit here and pick on those people, bro. Like, those people are in the facility to actually better themselves. So how the fuck are you going to sit here and be, like, picking on them? I just, I, just, I just don't understand that. I just don't understand that. Let me put it in a different perspective so people will fucking understand. Because some people, like, it's, it, it just doesn't register in their fucking head. It just doesn't register. And this is what I don't understand. So... I was talking to uh, a dude the other day, and I was telling him the story, and he was just like, yeah, man, he was just like, you know, he was just like, that's what that fat motherfucker deserves, and I'm just sitting there, and I'm like, yo, what the fuck are wrong, like, what is wrong with people, like, what is wrong with you guys, like, I don't understand that, and then I, I thought, I was like, how can I put it into perspective where people will understand it, and it dawned on me, check this out real quick, all right, let's say that that woman running on the treadmill is your mom, right? And she's overweight and she's trying to lose weight to get fit, right? Cool. You're not going to pick on her, right? But somebody else may. Now, in a different area for people to understand it, what if your mom went to rehab, bro, right? because she was hooked on heroin and crack, right? And when she went to rehab, imagine somebody coming up and being like, <laughs> your mom's in rehab, bro. Like, that's the stupidest shit I ever heard. Like, that's the stupidest shit I ever... Normally, people go to rehab to better themselves. You know what I mean? And then you're going to sit here and talk shit about somebody being overweight, running on a treadmill, trying to do cardio to better themselves. I just don't fucking understand it, bro. And I guess people think that they can come up to me and, like, say whatever the fuck they want to. And, like, I'm not going to check them. I, I promise you, bro, you can ask anybody about me, bro, in real life, I'll be straight up with you. I don't give a fuck. Like, I don't care if people like me. I'm not going to lose any sleep. I mean, I have people that say they hate my videos because the way I talk and the way I act. Honestly, I don't give a shit. You're not going to make or break my day. If you disappear from the earth, I'm going to keep my shit moving every day regardless. But I just want to clarify this. Up that, that's the wife he texts in, bro. Let, let me make sure everything is good. Because <laughs> y'all know she be beating my ass, right? She said, what am I doing? Making a YouTube video, baby girl. 
But um, nah, like seriously, bro, I just don't understand how you guys can come into the gym and pick on somebody who's overweight and trying to better themselves. Like I, I completely just don't understand it. And if you have any comments or remarks, please keep them to your fucking self because like I said, I will G-check your ass real quick. I don't play about shit like that. Being from a guy that used to be very overweight and pre-diabetic and everything, I, I don't take that shit very likely. Where like when I sit here and see people picking on people in the gym that's trying to better themselves, like it, it hits a fucking notch in my head, bro, and I kind of snap a little bit. So if you ever come up to me, bro, and you want to talk shit about somebody in the gym, it better be for one reason and one reason only. Either this dude is talking shit like he's somebody and like he's doing quarter squats with like five plates or something, then yeah, okay, fuck that guy. But if you see any Anybody in the gym, man. And, and, and this is this is another reason that people like that don't go to the gym. Now I understand people are gonna sit here and say all day long, it's their fault that they're fat and that they're overweight. Yes, one one hundred percent. You know what I mean? I feel like everybody has an option to get into a gym or walk at a park or anything like that, change their diet. They they one hundred percent have that control. But if they're actually at the point in their life where they're trying to fix it, there is no reason that you should be picking on them. And like let's say that dude had a walked up to that guy or somebody maybe overheard him talking to me and walked up to him and was like, hey man, them two guys over there picking on you. You know what I mean? One, I just developed a bad rep. And two, you probably heard that guy's feeling. He's probably never going to come to the gym again. You know what I mean? So th guys, start thinking before y'all fucking speak to people in the gym, bro. Because coming from like, I'm not a bodybuilder. I train like I'm a bodybuilder and a power lifter and or power builder, whatever you want to say. But look, man, just... Just start fucking giving help of hands to motherfuckers in the gym, bro. If a dude asks for advice, help the guy, man. Don't kick motherfuckers while they down. Now, I will tell you one thing. My motto in life, no matter what you're going for. Now, this will not be the last time. This does not even fucking pertain to the video, okay? This doesn't even pertain. You know what? If you, if you want to hear the, my motto in life, I will make a complete video on it. Like a motivational style video. And I will tell you what my motto in life is. Not, <laughs> I know what some people are gonna think. They're gonna be like, you talking about that other motto? No, I will legitly tell you my motto in life, bro. I'm a firm believer in it. Don't forget as always, tell your moms, tell your aunts, tell your baby sisters. Hey, look, again, I do apologize for the rant, bro, but I feel like that was kind of fucked up for that dude to do that. And like, again, like I said, I'm not giving out any names, but start being respectful in the gym, man. Appreciate you guys.